Hey you guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we're going to do a protective hairstyle that you can either use to protect your hair from this cold weather or to transition to natural hair. And besides protecting it, of course, you're going to look pretty because it's a beautiful hairstyle. So I just hope you like this video. And without more further ado, let's begin. For today's video, the main characters are the products from Hair Under Their Collection and I'm so excited to try them and the reason why I'm excited to do it is because these products are specifically designed to take care of our hair when wearing protective hairstyles. I'm starting with this toxic cleanser and if you want to pamper your scalp, let me tell you that you need to get this one. This makes my scalp feel so fresh and clean and one of the reasons why it does that is because one of its main ingredients besides herbal tea is also menthol piperidine. Oh my god you guys, I love this ingredient in shampoos because it just helps me to de-stress myself, it just helps me to relax and makes my hair and scalp feel clean. After that, definitely pleasant to rinse out. The next step is using a hair mask. I will be using this is Strengthen Me Moisture Mask, which conditions, moisturizes, and strengthens and protects your natural hair under the hairstyle you decide to do. Also, this hair mask has a really nice smell, a thick texture, and I will leave it on my hair for 15 minutes. Ladies and gentlemen, one of my favorite products of this collection is the soothing scalp potion which is similar to the shampoo with the cooling effect but you don't have to rinse this out. You can use it before the installation of your protective hairstyle to protect your scalp and also after you take it out to pamper your scalp and moisturize it. Now I'm going to apply this bombarding conditioner which makes my hair feel so hydrated and moisturized i really love this product and the direction supplied is before the installation of any protective hairstyle you want to do now that my hair is ready to be braided i will start dividing it into two sections and the hairstyle i want to do today is the short box spray hairstyle but i want to do it with the bob shape haircut because I always like it, that haircut and I will definitely want to try with these braids. So according to this bob haircut, there must be a short side. That's the short side and this side is the longer one. Now I'm dividing my hair into my first small square which will become our first braid. And just wanted to remind you that we are on the short side. So here I am with my expensive hair of one dollar and I will be cutting it off in the middle i'm going to be cutting this hair in the middle just because i'm doing short box breaks if i were going to do long box breaks i wouldn't cut it in the middle but i don't need that long hair for this hairstyle so after cutting it off i'm going to be taking a small sections like this in order to make each braid now i will be using this technique that my haitian friend taught me just look at this i'm going to divide that hair into sections and then i'm going to take one section and we'll hook it around the middle of the other section and after your hair is ready it will look like an x just like this before starting braiding i'm going to be using this protect me edge styling pomade in order to protect my edges and also in order to blend my hair with the hair extensions I will be using the rubber band method, it's easier for me and I think everyone can do it that way so as this is a tutorial I want everyone to be able to do it and that's the only one I know so yeah guys use your rubber band. Now I'm taking my hair with the trick I did and I'm gonna put it on the rubber band and then I'm gonna start braiding as usual. As you can see, the ends of my hair were not blended that well, so I just applied some more pomade and focused on the ends of my hair, and it actually worked. I really like the results, so if you are in the situation that your hair is not blending well with your hair extensions, you just have to apply some more pomade. Now I will tie up my hair with a rubber band, and this is what the whole short side of my hair looks like when braided. Now all you have to do is to repeat the process, all the things we did on the other side we're going to do them on this side too But remember this side must be longer than the one we did because we're trying to make a bob haircut shape And in order to do that we will need a longer and shorter side 
now that we're almost done i'm going to try adding some hair accessories but before adding them i have to burn the ends because the brakes are too thick so if i don't do it they won't be able to go through the hole of the accessories so it's really important that if your brakes are as thick as mine you burn your ends first before adding your hair accessories So here's the final result and I just love how this braids looks on me. I really hope you like them too. I already took off my brakes and after a week my hair was still moisturized. So yeah, the products work out really good on my hair. And yeah, you guys, that's the final result. I hope you like this video. If you like it, please like, comment, and subscribe. And also follow on my Instagram. Thank you so much for watching and see you on my next video. Bye.